Hey guys, welcome back to another race. Um, this race is in Locust Gap, PA. Again, it's literally right down the street of where we had the last race. So I think I should mention that I got a new GoPro, as you can obviously see, I mean the quality is like 10 times better, but sadly I put the pro shot on a little bit too low, so the majority of the race you can't really see ahead. I will fix it, I promise, on the next video, but for now you're kind of just stuck with it, I'm sorry.
So this was amazing because right here I just find a line and I just go straight through and then I pass everyone here and I think at this moment I'm in first or second place in my class and so honestly right here I was really just vibing. Until we get to here, uh, here I'm not vibing. Uh, I kind of get lost because there were like three areas that you could go into. And I was like, well, where do we go? Like all these kids are in different ways. And so I'm like, oh shit, not again. What? It was kind of just like a mess. I mean, a lot of girls in my class also cut up to me. We all cut up to each other. Um, but eventually I find the trail again just keep going. So I'm just riding, doing my thing until I see this kid oh stuck in that deep ditch and I was like, oh my god. Like, how do you even get out of that? <laughs> to tell but like all of a sudden you go up this hill and it's like totally off camera and I fall here I know um, and not gonna lie I kind of got stuck here for a while uh, shout out to Dan Morton who helped me you're amazing um, but uh, I think this fall really took a lot out of me and when I was stuck there like every single girl in my class passed me so I was pretty much in last so I think it might burst my ego a little bit and kind of made me lose my confidence. So I see this kid in the middle of the trail and I'm like, what are you doing? Like, keep going. Until I realized that the guy on the side was warning him of this huge hill, which the second lap, I don't do so well on, you'll see. But this hill was like almost 90 degrees, it was crazy.
god. Woo! You got it! I don't know if it was my fault or the bike's fault, but my brakes weren't really working that well and I couldn't slow down. And I knew I was losing control and at the end I think I just hit the rubber up. And um, I fell pretty hard. Now I cut like a lot of it out of me just sitting there. I was sitting there for a good five minutes. I, I got the wind knocked out of me. I think I got whiplash. I thought I had a concussion because I hit my head pretty hard. But good news, I don't have concussion. I just have a couple bruises and cuts. Other than that, I, it just took a lot out of me. But I just want to give a huge shout out to everyone that was there at the bottom of the hill. Thank you guys so much. Um, you guys were amazing. Um, pouring water on me, making sure I didn't have concussion, you know, doing the concussion test and all that. And, you know, I think I, what I really needed was just a little break. But thank you guys so much. You guys are amazing. So after that fall, I was like, I'm done. But the crazy thing was, while I was sitting there on the ground, all I was thinking was about was like, I have to get through scoring because I didn't want to DNF. Um, so here, I'm just really just taking it slow. Like all I care about is just finishing at the very least. Honestly, I was just glad to be done at this point, you know, like, ah, oh, it's the end, thank God. You know, you know you're close to the end once you see more and more people. That was the race. Thanks guys so much for watching. I want to say congrats to everyone in my class, and I'll see y'all later. Bye!